The Young and the Restless reveal that Ashley's trying to stop Tucker's plot despite knowing that he certainly won't give up easily. Besides, Billy and Jack also hope that she shouldn't take risks with her plans. Cole also unexpectedly returned recently, but he's taken time to worry about Victoria. But does the writer then intend for Cole to help Ashley get over her relationship with Tucker? After all, they had happy times together, and he wasn't as bad and dangerous as Tucker. Cole's also been close to Victoria recently, and will that reunite him alongside Victoria? After all that year, it was Victoria who suggested breaking up over Eve's problems. Currently, she's also quite busy with work and still preoccupied with relationships with Nate. So her desire to return to Cole's side may not happen, although Victor himself felt it would be much better for his daughter to connect with Cole. Currently, although Cole is still not sure whether Claire is his daughter or not, with Victoria's influence, he can't help but help her. The two of them not only find a way to help Claire escape prison, but also want her to quickly integrate into the Newman family, knowing full well that it would be very difficult, although it's possible that Cole may become close to Victoria in the near future. Many fans also directly direct their attention to Ashley. The person is also having her problem and Cole can have help her solve it. Maybe his return to Genoa City is actually a lot busier this time around. Make time to follow the latest details for running the drama. Cole's also worried about Victoria's condition, and she has been working too hard lately, but remember, Eve was also the reason the couple broke up, when he chose to be with Ashley at the time. Although they have things to do together, it seems that Victoria is not really moved by him that much. Ashley might be the one to make him stay here instead of her. We believe that the upcoming plot will not disappoint you too much. However, it can't be denied that Victoria has recently become more distant from Nate, especially since she didn't defend him before. Will this cause Victoria to find new happiness and will she be able to see Cole again? Ultimately, over time, Victoria also changed a lot, and the two of them became more mature and began to change past conflicts. But does Cole himself feel like he wants to be with her, or is Ashley still something he's preoccupied with? Surely Cole will return to Genoa City to see Ashley again and their old feelings will soon form. As for the fans, what do you think about what's going on? Please leave your comments below and let us know. Will this be a whirlwind love triangle or not? The screenwriter also seems to like this as his TV series is currently revolving around the love story of Phyllis, Christine, and Danny. The Young and the Restless reveals that Jordan has caused a lot of trouble for the Newman family and of course that intention will not stop. Now she's planning a new plan. Currently Jordan is hiding a shabby house outside the city to avoid attracting attention. But will Jordan have any plans in the near future? She constantly remembers her sister while lying in bed and is determined to make the Newman family pay for everything. Not only that, Jordan also tried to update the situation in Genoa City, but does she know about Claire's involvement? Jordan believes that everything should end here soon and she should not live her life in hiding without doing anything. On the other hand, the Newman family is still trying to deal with the past troubles. Perhaps Jordan will expand his offensive goals here, but is it worth it? Because they weren't the ones causing her problems anyways. So take the time to follow the de latest details surrounding the drama. Abby was also less involved in her family's affairs when she got married and she was busy taking care of her children, but that really ended recently when Victor lied to everyone. She felt uncomfortable when she didn't know Victor was sick, but then heard that he had deceived everyone to test his loyalty. That's the same reason why she was a Newman, but wasn't targeted by Jordan like Adam was. She also recently heard news from her family, but whether she will take the initiative to visit them remains to be seen. Even Devin hopes she can do that because he knows her better than anyone else. Ultimately, Jordan will still target those who she believes deserve to be in danger, but will Abby be able to help protect her family this time? For fans, what do you think about this issue? Dominic is Victor's nephew, so will he become Jordan's target? Surely this time Abby will not sit still and go to her father to criticize this. Dominic is the type of person who is not suited to excitement, and if he falls into Jordan's hands, his mood will definitely become unstable, so Abby and Devin will try to find their son at all costs. Abby's also busy with her work and hopes Nikki can watch Dominic for her. Since their nanny's on leave, but she didn't know that Nikki was hiding her bad mood from everyone, so Jordan quickly sees the opportunity. Jordan will do everything to kidnap Dominic and threaten the Newman family to do what he wants. Could this cause both Tucker and Chance to join in the search for the boy? But is this her smart plan? Dominic's like Abby's life, so she definitely won't forgive Jordan. And of course, if she caused any influence in the boy, the situation would definitely be uncomfortable. Therefore, we'll soon update the latest details so you don't have to wait too long. The Young and the Restless reveals that although past feelings have caused Sally a lot of pain in the end, it seemed like she still wanted to give Adam another chance. Will he finally grasp this well and prove his love? Please take the time to follow the latest details surrounding the movie. Sally has also previously offered to break up with Adam when he made the decision and left her heartbroken despite Victoria and Victor constantly pressuring her. Nick's caring support brought the two together, and despite her later becoming pregnant with Adam's child, he was still willing to accept mother and child. 
and this quickly causes all three to fall into all sorts of difficult relationships. Not long after that, the child unfortunately passed away and Sally felt all the blame was Adam's fault, even though he was, hadn't done anything. But at that time, Nick was not by her side and she felt unimportant in his life. Perhaps this causes Sally to constantly make decisions that surprise everyone. She also stabilized her mood and arranged to meet Adam to talk. But after that, the two continued to go to bed together, with the upcoming love story of the two of them really develop as expected. Adam was also very pleased when Sally chose to be by his side instead of Nick's. Nick is disappointed, but Adam feels that the only person he cares about is Sharon and hopes to respect Sally's decisions. And he affirms that he will protect his woman at all costs. For fans, do you think the relationship between Adam and Sally will last? Please leave your comments and thoughts below. We'll soon update the latest episode so you won't have to wait too long. Although Nikki has previously struggled to quit drinking, will she really do well this time? Especially recently since she's always been in a state of excitement about hurting himself. So it'll make people will start paying more attention to her. She will sneakily start drinking to control the situation. But this will not be the situation and this will not be hidden for too long. Although he clearly understands what Jordan caused, Victor will not be satisfied with her solution. And even at this point, Nikki will make some serious mistakes that will cause great losses to the Newman family. Fans can realize that every place in the family has become a hiding place for Nikki's alcohol. But why didn't she have the courage to tell the truth? She was afraid that people would be disappointed or at times the situation would be much worse. It seemed like she wanted Victor to focus on capturing Jordan and then she would tell him everything herself. Currently, Victoria constantly visits her mother hoping she can forgive Crail, but it seems she will refuse to meet. Not only was she unhappy about this niece, but she knew Victoria could realize her problems. And of course, Victoria will feel hurt by this and cause their relationship to grow further apart. Nikki's current situation is not stable enough for her to see the problem in the best light. 